you we'll leave the Bloomberg that. summit for just a quick moment for live coverage of the U.S. House. Members holding a brief pro forma session today, and then we'll return to more from the Bloomberg summit on debt, deficits, and the economy. The House will be in order. The chair lays before the House a communication from the Speaker. The Speaker's Rooms, Washington, D.C., April 30th, 2013. I hereby appoint the Honorable Andy Harris to act as Speaker pro tempore on this day. Signed, John A. Boehner, Speaker of the House of Representatives. The prayer will be offered by the guest chaplain, Reverend Dr. Brian Lee, Christ Reformed Church in Washington, D.C. Creator God, merciful and just, you dwell above in holiness, a father to the fatherless, protector of widows and orphans. Dear Lord, rescue the weak and needy. Deliver them from the hand of the wicked. Give wisdom to this body. You hold all things in your almighty hand, and you have established this House of Representatives and every governing authority as your servants, that they might protect the defenseless, praise those who do good, and punish those who do evil. Preserve and protect our President. Humble all these your servants with your holy law, which you shine forth in all our hearts. Help them to seek peace. You are a God who saves Convict us of all our sins, that we might know deliverance from these our wicked ways. Hear this prayer for the sake of the merits of your only Son, the crucified and risen Lord, Jesus Christ. Amen. Pursuant to Section 2A of House Resolution 178, the Journal of the Last Day's Proceedings is approved. The chair will lead the House in the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. The chair lays before the House the following communication. The Honorable the Speaker, House of Representatives, Sir, pursuant to the permission granted in Clause 2H of Rule 2 of the Rules of the U.S. House of Representatives, the Clerk received the following message from the Secretary of the Senate on April 30, 2013, at 10.41 a.m., that the Senate requests the return of the bill to make corrections in the engrossment of the bill, Senate 853. With best wishes, I am, signed sincerely, Karen Al Haas. The clerk will read the privileged message from the Senate. Ordered.
that the Secretary be directed to request the House of Representatives to return to the Senate the bill, Senate 853, entitled An Act to Provide the Secretary of Transportation with the flexibility to transfer certain funds to prevent reduced operations and staffing of the Federal Aviation Administration and for other purposes, and that upon the compliance of the request, the Secretary of the Senate be authorized to make corrections in the engrossment of the aforementioned bill. Signed, Nancy Erickson, Secretary. Without objection, the request is granted. Pursuant to Section 2B of House Resolution 178, the House stands adjourned until noon on Friday, May 3, 2013. And the House returns next week from their week-long break. We'll have live coverage when they gavel back in here on C-SPAN. Well, the Bloomberg Summit on Debt, Deficit, and the Economy is underway all day today here in Washington. I have to tell you, we are having some trouble with our live signal.